Dear viewers, I'd like to talk about early stage gastric cancer and advanced endoscopy. In the past, stomach cancers were very difficult to diagnose at an early stage because we didn't have advanced endoscopes and we usually skip them. However, nowadays we have the ability to catch early stage cancer easier with frequent screening and the use of advanced endoscopes. Now, I'd like to introduce you to one of these cases. We examined a patient who was referred to us for bleeding and detected a bleeding focus at the lower end of the esophagus. But when we were dealing with this bleeding focus, we detected a lesion the size of a small coin on the left side of this lesion. It is going to be on this video now. Yes, you see it on the left. There is a flat lesion with a darker base and we suspected this area and wanted to study it closely and apply advanced endoscopic methods. So we did a chroma endoscopy. As a result, we found that the microvascular structures and microarchitectures at the base were damaged. Then, as it was close to the lower end of the esophagus, we decided to start the examination from that area and started examining it by going down the lower end of the esophagus. There is a coin-like lesion here and we think it might be early stage stomach cancer, but we are looking to see if it is up there too. And we realized that apart from this lesion, there were cell distortion and clover-like tortures, focal distortion of vascular structures, as you can see at the lower end of the esophagus. Yes, we follow it farther down. We are slowly going down. We are inspecting it very precisely, millimetrically, because we don't want to skip a separate cancer focus at one millimeter frame. Because we want to remove early stage stomach cancer from a lesion that looks like a coin. That is why we are studying the closed tissues of its surroundings in great detail. The size of the vascular structures you have seen here is about 10 microns, 1% of 1 millimeters. There is a clear line of cancerous area below at 1 to 2 o'clock. The bottom is intact. There is a deterioration in the microarchitecture in the area where the cancerous area is. There is a thinning of the vascular structure at the base, tortuosity at the edges. So, after all, there is early stage cancer here. If we didn't have this advanced endoscopic technique, this would easily go unnoticed. For this reason, we recommend that especially at high-risk families, those with stomach cancer in their family, smokers should have advanced endoscopy.